This video was created during the 2023 WGA and SAG strikes. Without the labor of the writers and actors currently on strike, Ahsoka wouldn't exist. Learn more about the strike at the link in the description. How is there an ancient map pointing the way to Thrawn's location when he only went missing like 10 years earlier? I think that's a very valid question that we don't yet have a full answer to, but I think the latest episode gave us a solid theory. The map itself seems to contain charts of lots of systems and galaxies, not just the one where Thrawn happens to be. Elsbeth uses her magic and the ruins to single out a specific galaxy, but I wonder if that site could be used to point the way to other various locations, or maybe there are other ruins like this that will line up to other points in space. Balin calls the site a reflex point, so maybe there are others across the galaxy, but the important thing about this scene is that Morgan aligns the map and the ruins up to a galaxy surrounded by crude illustrations of Pergil. Those are the creatures that we have seen in The Mandalorian and Ahsoka and in Star Wars Rebels they were instrumental in Thrawn's disappearance. In the series finale, Ezra summoned several of them to attack his fleet and use their natural abilities to access hyperspace to jump Thrawn's flagship to this new, far galaxy. My theory is this. The galaxy Morgan is searching for may be the origin point for the Pergil. Maybe they were from that galaxy and traveled to the main Star Wars galaxy long ago, but whoever made the map knew where they originally came from. The most recent episode discussed the Pergil further, saying that long ago intergalactic hyperspace routes were charted using their migration patterns. So the map might simply be that, not a map to Thrawn specifically, just a way to chart a path to where Morgan thinks he will be. I think Morgan knows how Thrawn went missing and is following the best lead she has. It's more of a hunch than any hard evidence, but she has added confidence because she thinks Thrawn is calling to her across space and time which I still think is someone or something else, but we'll have to wait and see how that plays out. Anyway, that's my theory on how some ancient map can help both our heroes and our villains find characters who went missing far more recently. Let me know what you think of it, or if you have your own theories, leave them in the comments. If you haven't already, please like this video, subscribe to the channel for all our Ahsoka coverage, follow us on our socials, and consider checking out our Patreon page. As always, thanks for watching, and may the Force be with you.